So what are we doing in the Travado today? We're going to celebrate the 4th of July. How are we going to do that? We're going to go get something to eat, take it up on the Blue Ridge Parkway, find a spot where we can watch the fireworks. And should be fun. Should be interesting. Here we go. Here we go. Driving by, we're driving by all these people that are already sitting out in North Wilkesboro so they can watch the fireworks here. But we're not sure what we're going to do now. Heading to town, it looked like we were going to have enough time to drive all the way up to the Blue Ridge Parkway and find a place to, to view the fireworks from Tweetsie, but it was going to be close. <laughs> After we passed these fire trucks that were heading to their parade, we looked at the clock and we had maybe 10 minutes to spare. There wasn't a lot of time, but I thought we were gonna make it still. But we still had to stop at Kentucky Fried Chicken and pick up a bucket of chicken that we could take up to the parkway to have our picnic. That was a priority for me, not so much so for Lynn. We haven't been to Kentucky Fried Chicken in a long time. It took us forever to order because we don't really know what to order. Anyway, we're getting chicken so we can go sit up on the Blue Ridge Parkway and watch the fireworks. Sure hope they don't go off before we get there. So I paid for our order at Kentucky Fried Chicken and went back outside to meet Lynn and Maggie. And walking out and looking at my watch, I realized we were gonna miss the fireworks if we tried to drive all the way to the Blue Ridge Parkway. So fate kind of handed us the opportunity to go to another plan B, which was we were gonna go where we took this sunset picture the night before and see if we could see the fireworks from there. But <laughs> when we got there, we realized there's no way in the world over all the little mountains we were gonna be able to see the fireworks in the air from there. So we went on to uh, our original plan B, which was to go to what is known around here as Sewer Fest. The wastewater treatment plant in Wilkesboro actually created a little campground for when Merle Fest comes to town. And it's become quite popular. So we drove over there, found a really cool place to park, got our chairs out, sat there and ate our chicken and waited on the fireworks to begin. Here's what we're seeing at Sewer Fest as we get ready for the fireworks here in Wilkes County. Beautiful sunset. Maybe cool in. Ian and I are just chilling by the Travada. One of the neat things about being over there was seeing all the people that were there just to see the fireworks also. These guys pulled in right beside of us just before the fireworks were gonna start. They all climbed out in the back of their little pickup truck and they started playing cards. They introduced their dog to Maggie, but Maggie was eating chicken and she wasn't gonna have anything to do with another dog trying to get her chicken. So that didn't go very well. Some of the time here. <laughs> playing playing game of Shanghai Rub. Is that difficult to play? Uh, well, we just relearned how to play it tonight. Yeah. So, so did you? We're still working bad. out the rules. So which one of you knew how to play it? No, she uh, did. Wikipedia, All three Wikipedia of us. did. <laughs> <laughs> Wikipedia. Yeah. What is your dog's name? This is Scuppers. Hey, Scuppers. I know. He looks a lot like Maggie. Look. Yeah, they, I think you guys have it figured out over there. So finally, the fireworks began, and from where we were seated, we had a really good spot to watch the fireworks. There probably weren't 100 people around us, maybe, maybe 150, several cars. But in town, it's a zoo. Sometimes we'd go to town and, and watch the fireworks there, and the traffic to get back home is, is horrendous. So we felt so fortunate that we were where we were.
So we're sitting out here, the fireworks kind of ended. They kind of sputtered a little bit. Mm -hmm. And we're kind of sitting here wondering if maybe that was all she wrote. We're thinking that's Bob's your uncle on the fireworks. They did a really good grand finale and then it looks like somebody walked over and said, wait a minute, we forgot to shoot these two little ones. So they shot those two little ones. Kind of led us to believe there was gonna be more, but I don't think there's gonna be. This may not be the normal kind of video that we do. We realize that. I mean, everybody's seen fireworks and, and everybody's tried to take video and pictures of fireworks and it's really, really hard to do. But Lynn and I hope you've enjoyed this video in some way. We're gonna spin around some of the pictures and photos that we took while we were waiting and watching. Some of the sunset photos are just phenomenal. So if you enjoyed everything, please take a few moments to like this video and we would really appreciate it if you would subscribe and maybe help us spread the word so that more people see what we're trying to do here on this little channel. Well, that wraps up this video. Lynn and I are extremely excited that you watched to this point. We thank you for doing that. We hope you had a wonderful and safe and happy 4th of July. Remember what it means to us here in America. We always do. We count ourselves very fortunate that we live in this land of the free. We're glad you follow along with us as we zigzag around this little round world and our little van I'm sitting in. Thanks for being here.